Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel again. Today we will uh, learn about Simatech Manager software, how to create the configuration I.O. or CPU for simulation. Okay, so uh, first let's open the software. Okay, and then uh, create the new project. Example uh, project. Example tutorial. Tutorial one. Uh, hardware config. Okay, hardware config and then uh, we will uh, create the new folder for uh, this project example uh, schematic manager hardware config okay so we can uh, browse to find this the uh, folder that we already created okay then click ok and ok again okay we will get the new project so first we need to create the rack for the PLC. To create the rack, right click here and then insert the object. Okay. In this uh, simulation program, I use Simatic 300 station. Okay. So let click Simatic. 300 station okay so uh, it will uh, insert automatically when we click simatic 300 station then uh, double click here and then go to hardware yes this is a blank not yet create some break or some IO okay so let uh, create the break first in the right hand side we see a lot of uh, station like S1 uh, Symatic 400 300 Profinet IO, Profibus DP, okay, many many components that we uh, can use. Okay, so uh, first I will create the rack for Symatic S1 uh, 300 first for simulation. Okay, so uh, let uh, click the rack 300 and then uh, we will see the real okay so to uh, create from this to this we just drop and drop from this and then uh, drop here okay we will get the one station that uh, it have uh, 11 slot for uh, PLC IO okay so uh, first we will continue to create the power supply for slot number one okay 
power supply PS in mean that power supply 300 so we can choose 5M 2M or 10M to make as the same the hardware of the real PLC okay so right now I will choose 5M okay so I drop and drop here okay power supply 5M this is the order number of this power supply and then uh, we can check here 120 until uh, 230 AC volt then uh, 20 volt uh, DC output 5 m ok so uh, the next we must create the CPU right to create the CPU click CPU 300 and then this is a all of CPU product that include inside this software when we install the software it will uh, create automatically this uh, all this model number okay for example I choose CPU uh, 3.4 and then uh, the version 3.3 .3, okay so I can uh, draft and drop this okay CPU 340 sorry uh, 314 this is a part number sorry order number and version and this is the address of MPI address number 2 it is default okay so uh, after that we will create the IO right example first create the digital input yes to create the digital input go to uh, IM 300 okay sorry uh, SM 300 here we have uh, DI, DIDO, and AI, also AIAO, and uh, it also have the special module. Yes, special module also. So first, I will create the new DI digital input module. Uh, 16 bit 24 voltage okay so drag and drop here and the uh, second I will create the new DO digital output module 16 bit also then uh, I will create one more for analog input and one more for analog output module okay so this is the address it automatically create okay the next we will uh, download for simulation okay so uh, before download click save the program first okay and then uh, minimize then go to here and then click simulation on off okay so click simulation okay and then uh, click run piece for run the CPU 
then go to uh, option set PG PC interface then go to uh, PPI then go to uh, PLC stream MPI okay go here PLC sim MPI and then click OK and then OK again yes so uh, right now the CPU still run so we uh, will download the configuration first to download click this button download to module and then click uh, select all click OK and click view for view the, the CPU yes it means that this CPU ok again so the CPU will stop and download ok and it will uh, run again so uh, this is a video how to create the hardware configuration and download for uh, PLC S1 300 to uh, Schematic Manager version 5.6 okay so right now we already download the hardware to CPU so right now we will create the program for test example I have one block for OB1 so I will create the same power program okay first uh, create the one button example uh, I 0.0, .0. Okay. You can go to check inside the hardware for address here. Digital input start from zero, and uh, it will uh, has sixteen bits. Okay. So. And then output will start from 4.5. Okay, so uh, I will start from uh, Q 4.0. Okay, then uh, download this logic to the CPU again, and we can online for check. Okay, to see uh, the status. Now it's running by simulation with our uh, PLC. Okay, so right now uh, I will test this I/O. So first, select the IB right, and then here's the QB. QB4 start from 4 right okay so uh, when I push the I0 the QB4.0 will on okay so it is true if I turn off the output will turn off also okay so this is a how to simulation and download the program to the CPU S Band 300. So uh, thank you very much for watching my video and please don't forget uh, like and subscribe my video also. 
and uh, we will see you next video.